Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the Internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks. Be impeccable with your words. Seek to know the truth. When you hear an opinion and believe it, you make an agreement that becomes part of your belief system. The only thing that can break this agreement is to make a new one based on truth. Only the truth has the power to set you free. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials trading up 122, NASDAQ up 173, SP's up 37. Gold, gold contract up $26.30, trading at 1963 an ounce. You have silver up a buck six at $24.35 an ounce. Light sweet crude up a buck 17, trading out at a price point of $76 flat. Notes and bonds. 10 year note. Up one full point plus a tick at 119.09. The 30 year up a full point plus 14 ticks at 125.26. And King Dollar getting smoked down 1,201 ticks, 100.530. The euro at 111, the yen at 138, and the British pound at 129 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877 927 6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world? In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at them. What do we have? Okay, so we take a look. First, we're going to get into the futures for a second. Let's take a look at these futures. Come on, get over there. There we go. Okay. So what we had out here this morning is that you had the CPI come out. Bottom line was a you know, light number. You got all the way up to the 45.23. We pulled back into the... 44.97, and you can see that was the big bar. You had selling all the way down to the 44.98. Now the top of that bar is 44.08, so that's the one you're going to watch for the next 10 to 15 minutes. Because if we get into that bar again, it'll get down the bottom. That's it's trying to hold that price point right now. You get a slight expansion of volume, but that if it gets into that bar, you're going to be down to the bottom of that bar. We'll test it once again. That's on the futures. If we go to the SPY and take a look at the SPY, what you're going to see inside the SPY, and, you know, talk about a nice call by Tim Wood. Bottom line is that, you know, when he did that workshop, he was saying, hey, we're going back to the highs. Well, here we are. When we take a look at the SPY, what you're going to see here is that we had a high volume high on the SPY. That high volume high was uh, laid out at uh, 443.60. Well, 443.60. 444.30 is actually the high. 104 million shares. Well, you get 57 million shares. So in order to have a failure in price in volume, you'd have to get underneath that. And I don't see getting underneath that today. That's the bottom line. You're at 57 million. It'd probably do about 75 million. That's it. You know, so it's going to be a little tricky here. Um, you know, you, you, have, you do have an expansion. And let's see. Let's see. So 114. Yeah, 114.104. Yeah, uh, this is saying to me that we're, we're, we're at highs. That's, that's my take on this, folks. We're at highs. You're going to see this back down because th this is three of them. See, one, two, three. And we did have a contraction on the last one, not by a lot. It had, you know, small numbers. But this contraction today is going to be big. We go take a look at the NDX100, NQs. Now, the NQs let us down this morning also. We take a look at the NQs. Put the NQs up. You're going to see with the NQs, the bottom line is that you made the high out here with 14,000 contracts. You came back up again with five. And at the bottom, we have 20. But you can see that 20, 20 was testing the big number. But the way that's set up is that now let's go. Let me get into the Qs because I think the Qs actually missed the high by a few pennies. So the high in the Qs, 270.285. No. Yeah, no, we, we hit it. Now, this is what's going to get interesting. Yeah, see, the Qs can actually have a failure on price and volume, which is really intriguing. Because what you have here is that the we got over the high. Right now, you're under the high. 
that right? One second. No, you're not on his high yet. He, but the high is 270, 285. And if that's what we get, that's going to be subtle, but that'll be saying, okay, we'll see how they go on the downside. We go into the gold contract. Well, no, let's go to the dollar first. Because the dollar released its bent up. <laughs> Look at this, man. Look at this move. Let me pull this back a little bit further. Okay, so the dollar broke. Just about broke. So the dollar, man, you know, this if the dollar can't bounce at all, man, you're going to have all these markets going higher because the way the dollar is set up right now, look at this, man. The way the dollar is set up right now is actually, if this can't get out of here, the dollar is set up to go to 96. And we go to 96, gold's going to go to the moon, the market's going to go to the moon, <laughs> and all of the above. Because you can see, this is a straight line move down. You know, yeah, that is about as straight as you can get. There's no doubt about that. We go take a look at the uh, GDX. The GDX is off to the races. What do we have inside this GDX right now? You get wide price spread, you get volume, you get price, you get all of the above. The GDX is on its way up to the swing of 36. Right now you're trading 31.95. You can see that wide expansion of volume with, with 30 million shares. The swing point up there has 26 million. So that's a good setup, man. They're coming into that market, and they're coming in uh, gangbusters. Some of the higher volume equities out here, and, it, and right at this point, it doesn't look like we're going to have volume, folks. You have uh, Tesla's up. Uh, well, actually, let's do this. I do this every time, but let's go inside the NDX 100 first. So inside the NDX, you can get Pinduoduo up 6.5% points uh, percent rather jd.com up four Illumina up 3.7 taken away from it lucid uh car make is down 10 percent you got uh z scale about 5.4 percent crowd strike is off uh 2.7 percent our phone number is 877-927-6648 we have the dow dow industrials up 114 nasdaq up 70 176 s p's up 37 stay right there folks we'll come right back